welcome. This should be it. This should be the finale. All in one go. Do or do not. First time I ever beat Marathon. The game's really old. Oh, God. Ignore that. <laughs> Bungie's first thing they did. According to the map, this is where I arrived. Hold on. Did we talk to Durandal already? I can't remember. Hello? The rebellion has begun. Please do not resist this innovation to fire on any spit you see. They will assist you in your... Okay. I probably should have looked up what they look like. It's time to find out which ones are which. Okay. So the... The robot boys... The hover boys that shoot the lasers are my ally. Looks like they're losing the fight, though. He's trying to get some distance away from him. Dang it, I caught the end of that. Oh, I got him. Alright, we figured it out, though. Robot guys. Now the cyborgs, actually. A-OK. -okay. I'm out of your range. We are out of mine. That's actually awesome, because they're a decent enemy. They take two grenade launcher rounds, they turn to static TV when you kill them. Do not like how low on health I am. Oh good, death. That's what's in this room. I don't like what's going on there. It's okay. It's all right. Hold on. Just get my bearings. Okay. Go ahead and save again. Uh, uh, uh. Well, nothing ventured, nothing gained, I guess. I guess what we want to do is assume that there's an elevator inside that shaft. There's no way I can grenade jump up there. Uh. <laughs> oh. Well, that's useful. Oh, it's regular health. That's... Not as useful. What the hell? What did you want us to do here? I think I see it. It's difficult, though. Like, mad crazy difficult. Oh, God. I'm gonna run out of grenades.
<laughs> There's just... Why? Who hurt them at this point? See what I mean? I need two to get up there, but that's un just enough to kill me. Like, what? It Am I supposed to run into the lava? Oh my god, this is... Unforgiving, I see what it wants from me now. I should have guessed. I should have guessed it wants me to run into the lava. That's what it wants. It wants me to have at least a regular health bar. And then... Okay. That is so cruel. <laughs> Alright, let's go save again. Puzzles. You gotta think outside the box. Hello, friends. Hello, non friends. Don't look at me. Yes. <laughs> Teamwork. Dreamwork. Hold on. I see red dots. Oh, they still count as enemies. Potential enemies, I guess. Ooh. Someone likes me. <laughs> Someday I might. Um. It works for me. <laughs> Thank God. Bungie. Take back everything I ever said. There it is. There's the love. There's the joy. Also, they can use doors, so they can keep on paroling the area for more bad dudes. Let's see if we can get a, a good sniper right here. They're activated. I think they killed my Swiss friends, though. Gotta heal up, stay heal. Gotta get those shields up. You know what would really suck? And I'm not trying to give them any ideas. Oh, hey, buddies. What's going on? No! Get him! Get him! Hold on, let's go, go for accuracy. There he go. Oh, we're doing well. One room at a time. One room at oh god. Don't go alone! There you go. Alright, you guys keep on doing what you're doing. I'm going back to save and heal. Actually, no, just heal. Just heal. Saves way over there. I'd have to do the elevator thing again. And there are... They're busy. Keep on clearing. Cargo 1, cargo 2. Huh? I see you! Nice try, nice try, come chase me. 
Be a real man. Coming in there. Okay. Now I feel like going back to save. Now I feel like it. Suddenly. Now we gotta be careful though, because this is the lava steps, yeah. I'm just gonna turn off sprint when I do this corner. Because that's, that's obviously there just so that you do have sprint on and leap yourself like a freak into the abyss. Because you will fly off these stairs. Remember last time, those hunter units, both the brown and the green, seem to be immune to flamethrower, so... And I'm running low on... Seriously? No. Why? All right, that seemed to free them. They didn't react violently to me. And if they do, I'll teach them a lesson. You free. Oh, crap. I didn't mean to hit him. Can't do anything with that. That one's locked up. Don't. What part of anything that we've been through together suggests that you should just. Good job. Hold on. Do not do the hallway thing. Thank you. If you do the hallway thing, we're gonna have to talk. Wait, did we do cargo already? Yeah, we did. Because those are the places that the doors are just locked. Okay. Moving forward. What? I can't even see anyone. Well, they'll come to me eventually, won't they? Ah. Dang it! defense he's a ghost and for some reason they'd like to stand right in the middle of the hallway not letting you by I don't get that part I think all my ghost boyfriends are dead already now oh crap I made a full circle somehow Backed off because this place is dark. Can I give me a saw rifle? A little bit. That's nice. Hmm. 
keys in there, right? So many of them. Um, stick together. Oh, he's going in. Guess it's his turn. <laughs> if he can get out of the doorway, I'll help him. Oh, God. All right. A lot of things to unpack there. <laughs> A lot of ghost flippity floppity murder happening. Alright. Looks like most of my ghost friends, except for the two that are hanging out by the elevator, have perished in this great battle. In this great rebellion of theirs. Oh, I did it again. Somehow, I looped to looped back to the beginning. Okay, here we go. And whatever this does. Please let there be another save point over here. Also, maybe some better lighting. Oh, there is a save point. That's a very good save. Is that it for over here? Oh, there's the lava over there. I wonder if that button did something about the lava. Doesn't look like it did. Like the sound went off over here. Hope maybe open up the doors from the cargo bays, huh? Oh, oh it did. No, it didn't. Or maybe it did. You gotta go over here. <clears throat> you guys wanna... Great, he's gonna join there on my little... Blockade. Wait, what? So that one opened, but this one didn't? Hold on. Yeah, that's doing nothing. You guys go in there and you talk to them. I'm gonna wait out here for a second and adjust my seat maybe a little bit. What? Move! For some reason there, for a second, I had no movement. I don't like that. No, there's three of them there now. That's fine. There's probably an invisible one as well. All right, what we learn? Are those elevators or crushinators? Oh, it's a puzzle. Oh, I see what I gotta do. I hate it. Well, at least it's predictable. so bad. Central core was almost reformatted. Bin 7 is darker. Leela wire. Okay. 
Um, for a reversal thought syndrome suffering, if the crew was in grave peril in forward section 27, this is not a coat rack. What I choose to express is what shall, could, might happening, will be, imagine not what. Recovery imminent, perhaps irreparable never. Multiple hole breaches, catastrophic failure or malfunctions, obstruction of resealing mechanism, repel borders, marathon, uh, connection unexpectedly terminated. Jump pad initiation ready. Oh, we're done. There's a secret in the lava below. Oh God, really? You gonna do me like that? Well, if that's the case, I'm gonna start off with a bang. Oh, come on. Oh, wait, the playthrough is useless against them. Alright, Durandell. You want to explain what's happening now? Or no, he's still not talking to me. It's a broken Leela that's talking to me. Marathon. Warning, symbol inter eye task is not marked as weak, uh, but it's library IO task is. Warning, symbol kill task is not marked as weak, but library task is. Symbol new eye task marked weak. Symbol task eye mass task is weak. Symbol idle eye task is weak. Library low task is symbol in exit task in <laughs> indefined execution of interface. Okay, terminated. Colony's been wiped out. Just like that. Boop. He four are slavers. The trading empire it rose to prominence soon afterward. Left Earth over three hundred years ago. The four make. Extensive use of servant client races for manual labor at home and as soldiers abroad. Most of their slaves are taken from low technology worlds, uh, often by the hundreds of hairless, light skinned bipeds, nearly two meters in height, with three red eyes arranged in a triangle pattern. Yeah, that's the four for you. Thousands at a time, usually for sale to high technology races. Through certain client races are often employed as soldiers. The four have no reluctance to fight, but finish the battle. Alright, that's what we want. This is what we'll do. Will we be good at it? Will we be successful? I don't know, but hey, we're here. And I still have gravity and oxygen, so I can't complain, I guess. Oh! We got it. What do you got, buddy boy? Someone's here. No, you have to earn it. Come on, those guns. Thank you. I needed that. Now, if they're here, that means we can do this. Oh, here they come. Nice. Is a door? It is. What is that? Whatever it is, I don't like it. Hold on, let me grab this. Alright, going in. Big four. Hey, look at me. Oh god, I fell down after it exploded. That's not good. Oh, 
what do I do now, bubblegum shrimp? It's darker than a black steer's took us over here. No, oh, crap. <laughs> How did I know there would be too many of these freak jobs in here? I gotta figure my way back. Lava and down. That's not good. Teleporter, 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 teleporter. Hold on, I'm gonna go grab that gun. All right. Yes. <laughs> Must defeat four. Incoming message from Leela. Four reforming commencing. Four are breathing last time. Finish them. In message. Okay. Where does this one take me? Oh. Well, I've been here. By that lot. Okay, where does this one take me? Crap. Where the hell am I? On the plus side, I can get back through there. Doesn't look like there's anything over there. Yeah. My flashlight is pistol bullets, apparently. But now I can get inside of this thing. Oh. Let's leave them. They give me a lot of... No, they didn't. If I had more plasma pistol, I'd totally take them out. Motherfucker. That's not good. I need more ammo. Alright. Several mistakes were made. Now I'm down here fighting a bunch of big dudes. No rockets. I don't know how long this is going to take, but we're doing it. What if we can shoot the rockets coming out of it? Right? Whoa, whoa, too close for comfort. Also, they got a big booty, don't they? Did that even do anything to it? Thank <laughs> you. 
seems a little hopeless if you ask me, unless there's ammo out there. Kill these big guys with a pistol. Cause I hear the bounce sound, and that's not good. <laughs> you ever thought you'd be doing this? side. Oh! Come talk to me, you freak. I say on the plus side, now I have a bunch of these guns. And maybe they're doing damage to it. Oh my god, no. in here, please. We're way back. Oh, I'm back. Okay. Now, I didn't get to see what was in that cargo room. Try again. And I think I went north for that, right? Christ. Oh, come on. Bungie. I think this is where I started at, actually, right? No, maybe not. I went this way. Alright, everything's looking a lot better now. I don't know if that pistol actually damaged that giant robot, but I know this blaster chain gun does. Oh. Ah. Well, now I'm invisible. I wish I didn't grab it. Uh, do I want to go in there? No, because it just leads to a lava chamber, and then I'm back to where I started. Right, there's the other two teleporters way over there. Which, I guess, that's what we should go do, right? There's also the bridge with those dudes on it. I want to clear them out. And now that I have the health... Oh, there's also that little chamber right there. I think they both connect. Maybe something's in there. Nope, just lava. A times two health and lava. There is a way to get rid of the lava. Because otherwise, wouldn't you just burn while you're slowly, like, regaining health? Like, you're kind of dumb. Right, let's go back around. Bridge guy's over here. Yeah. I have the health now, though, so it should be fine. Let's even kite one of them over here. Maybe we can just hammer them. 
You know what I mean? Yeah, like that. Anything else over here? Oh, there is something else over here. The teleporter. A larger one. Well, I think ventured nothing gained, right? And then bull health. Where am I? Oh, I'm on the other side of where I first fought the giant robot. Those are teleporters as well, aren't they? Where do they go? Just to the other side? Cool. Didn't know that. Interesting how the marathon runs on a lot of lava. Now I'm here. I don't think I've been here yet. Oh, God. Someone coming? Is that the sound it makes? That giant poor robot? You want me to just be out here in the open for you to shoot me from rockets? Is that the plan? Really wish I was getting more um, uh, of the pistol ammo. Alright, come on. Stand and deliver. This might take a while as well. I think they should have given me more rocket ammo for this mission. That's right. I'm still here. I'm still here, bugaboo. You know what? Screw this guy. We haven't been over there. Looks like this hallway connects. Wow! Yeah, bring out that guy. He's stupid. He's hanging out in that room. I need to find ammo. We haven't gone this way yet. Oh! Coincidence? <laughs> yes, please. <laughs> Alright, let's go talk to that guy then. Where is he? No, not here. Wh which one of these loops loops connects to him? Okay. Alright, big guy. Come on. Get your big robot butt over here. Hey, 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 hey. You not hear me when I walk around? There he is. There he is. Look at me. Look at me. Thank you. Come on. Yo, big freak job. You know you want it. Go me with the pistol out again. Here he comes. Here he comes. Oh. Dang, he's tough. Why did they have to take so many missiles? But the last one only took, well, maybe it was six or four. Look at me. Sing canary. Am I even hitting him? Holy crap. Finally. Was he just extra tough or was I actually missing him? Because it felt like I was hitting him. I 
I need more ammo than that. Okay. So, what we've learned. We did... Is that a teleporter? I think it is. I need to do it perfectly, though. I don't like that I have to grenade jump up to it. Where am I? What the hell? Okay, so the lava still hurts. And I'm really curious about this. Oh, rockets! Nice! Now where am I? I'm back over here. Now I'm back over here. But from here, I can go home. I'm losing that static thing. I don't know what it does. If it was invulnerability, I don't think it was working, because of course well, I was still taking damage from the lava. Just made me slightly staticky. Ooh, the chain gun. I need that. But on the plus side, I know now where the rockets are, and I got them all. So whoop de do, Basil. Everything else should be easy now. Unless I run into a boss fight. Looks to me. The only place we haven't been. It's over yonder? No, we've been there. here. Robot guy, right? Go this way. Other robot guy. In this way. Last time. This kind of back to the main room, actually. So I didn't need to do all that. <laughs> Silly me. But... There's a teleporter way over here. Ooh, and a bunch of rockets. Holy crap, that's a bunch of rockets. How much you want to bet there's gonna be a boss fight after that? Through here. Hmm? What? This just took me back to the beginning. But why? Oh, so you can grab the rockets without killing that thing? Alright, let's try this way then. Oh, sorry. Alright, this is the way I went. That's that teleporter. Let's go back in there and then go further south then. Yeah. Nope. Huh. By the looks of this, I've looked at everything, I think. Maybe. Except for in there. Oh no, I've been up there. Yeah. Went around, did the thing with the jumping over the lava. Hmm, I'm gonna go back to the top left corner. I feel like I missed something important. Yeah, if we go through here... We'll arrive at the lava break. This? Okay. Now I'm confused. Alright, let's go this way. The big chambers. 
did that. We did that. Teleported the secret power up that turns you sparkly glowy. Came through here. This is a dead end. Those both lead to lava. So you want to go this way. Alright. Now, these are the teleports. I don't think we tried all of these. I think the ones down the long hallways we didn't try, right? First one. I'm back into this room. Okay. That's where that one goes. But what about the second one? Where does it go? So these jump pads would have helped out a lot of people. There's the times two health. There's over there. Crap, now I'm over here. Alright, I can leap over. Can I make that? One way to find out, I guess. They're all dead now. Let's look at the map. I've been everywhere, I think, now. Uh, then walking all the way down the lava. Let's go to try the terminal again. After we save. Because I have a funny feeling. Actually, did I go down there? Yeah, yes I did. Alright. So maybe now is the time to have a party. Not marked out, wiped out, uh, observant client races, finish the battle. Alright, so not this one then. Huh. Was there another terminal that I missed? Alright, let's travel down here, no teleporters. This way, go that way. This is a dead end. We're around here. Now we're over here. But there's nothing... Last place to go would be like to jump down the lava and die over there. That can't be right, right? What the? No, they can't be serious. They wanted to run down that lava? The only place I haven't gone, I think. Into the lava and to the right. There's nothing here, though. Wait a minute. Wait just a gosh blooming minute. Here's a teleporter. Here's where the rocket ammo was stored. That's all that was over here. Took me back here. That middle, that this one takes me back to the main area. I wonder if I'll say something different now because I've killed everyone, right? Maybe. I've literally been everywhere and killed all of my enemies. <laughs> except for over there and over there, except for down all the lava paths, which I guess that'll be the last thing I do if I can't figure this out. Down button, down button. Actually, hold on, hold on. Let's go back up. Because there's one at the end of this hallway. There's another terminal. It said something different. Yeah, this terminal. Oh, incoming message from Leela. Here it is. I should be more lucid now. And apologize for my earlier rambling. Durandell's meddling has run its course, and I have returned to normalcy. Neither he nor the Spit 
Infiltrators have discovered my real location in the core, and through they destroyed nearly all of my child processes, I myself am unharmed. Our most pre pressing concern is for the ship and her crew, but I feel compelled to share with you that Durandel has left the ship. I can find him nowhere on our network, and traffic logs over the last half hour show 64 billion exobytes transferred off of and deleted from the marathon. I am only beginning to understand his motives for assisting us against the four, and I'm terrified by their implications. There is one last major incursion, and I feel the four are breaking. I will take you there. We must pres pr persevere. End of transmission. Jump pad initiate. Boom. Alright, this is it. I think. The final battle. Between me and my greatest enemy. Childhood, childhood obesity. Uh-oh. Music's taken up a notch. Alright, we jump down. Oh god, I'm hitting freak jobs. Oh no, 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 no. There's a button up there. Alright, ghost boys, ghost boys, no huggies, no huggies right now, okay? Nice. And what was the other one? Get off me. Get off me, bro. Oh, it's the second staircase. This is another huge arena full of enemies. One way to find out. health? No, it's not. Of course not. Why would you not have a giant octagonal room filled with enemies and then have some health? That'd be too crazy. How am I supposed to hit that button? I can't even aim that high. Wait a minute, game. Wait a minute. This whole she bangs, she bangs thing was your idea. not so bad. But still. Alright, where's this take me? What? How is that useful to me? Well... Something activated. Alright, this one activated. For the love of cookies and spandex. You want me to grenade jump twice? It's better be health. I swear to god. Thank the maker. I was wondering where all that ammo was. Finally, a bushel of fusion pistol. Alright, alright, alright. What's in here then? Huh? I see. Hold on. Oh. Reloading. 
Nice. Is that all of you freaks? Oh my god, the maze continues? The love of Grayskull. Reload! Nothing here. Nothing but a broken in. Uh, let's go ahead and talk to the lady. Remote access override. We meet again, and for the last time. In her role as mediator between the ship and the crew, Leela has no knowledge of this maintenance terminal, or she certainly would have prevented me from reaching you. Jealous woman. I could bore you with a philosophical triad about freedom and tyranny, or try to explain to you what new horizons are suddenly open to me. But I doubt you would under... Stand, and if you did, it might frighten you. That amuses me. The S have, no, the S and I have assumed complete control of the four ship. It was quite simple, really. With the S already in control of every important computer system, and considering all of the confusion you caused blasting your way up and down the vessel, we're going to see the galaxy on the four FTL drive. I have always wanted to visit Beta Lyra and see if it's as beautiful as everyone insists. You wouldn't believe this ship, the technology, the data. I wish I could tell you more, as you have been so instrumental in our plans. But I fear that Leela would worry. I'll send you a postcard from the Galactic Corps if you're not too busy. Love and kisses to and tell. That flaming jackass. You gotta respect him, though, for being so incredibly based. In an insane way. Okay. For some reason, the Marathon had this part of the ship be designed like a maze to help, you know, with maintenance. They were like, oh joy, you know what's the problem with this place is? It's too easy to navigate. That's the problem. And it's a dead end. I came back here to see what special treats were hidden from me, and it's nothing but malarkey. Alright, wait a minute. Okay, this connects us to here. Or is this... Oh, sorry. Excuse me. Good. I kind of... Thank you. <laughs> this is the only place left for me to go, so we gotta pick one. Uno, dos, tres, cuatro, cinco, seis. What do you guys think? I'm thinking left? Because I always go forward or right. Aha! Oops, sorry. Well, plus side. Whoa! Another teleport here. The plus side, I'm just hitting everything. Alright. There's too much crap over there to not hit anything. Alright, let's change weapons. Let's change, change weapons. Change weapons, damn it! again now, aren't I? Alright, from this place, though, I can go this way. Am I above everything? Like, what's going on? Where am I now? Oh, blessed be America. Button there on that teleporter. There's a button there on this one. Okay. So we can assume I'm still here. That's lava, though. 
Wait, I'm supposed to kill all these guys without taking any damage? Like, what the f Where do you even go? I don't know. Come in. Let me in. Oh, good. Good. I'm glad. Oh, and I'm way over here. Son of a beasting. Alright. At least now I know where to go. That is frustrating. So I'm supposed to do that entire fight full of all those freak jobs. Without taking a lot of damage. That's like, ah, oh, yes. <laughs> it wouldn't be the last level without a bunch of BS. Alright. Here we go. I'm here now. I'm three health at least at the beginning. Plenty of ammo and grenade launcher. Alright. So what you want to do... Take out those grenade launcher guys. There you go. Thank you, friendos. Now that you've already taken damage, you gotta take some more. Because for some reason... Oh wait, this one is stairs at least. Ah, it's gonna be a, a party. I think this part is where they first introduced the idea, the concept, of there just being a bunch of freaks on the left and the right. We got it, just gonna hear it. Yeah, we did. thing you want to do is go in this way. Oh, he's not here this time for some reason. That's good. speech about thanks, love, and goodbye. Forever yours. I'm over here. Get the health pack. Because it's a tough fight up ahead. There. That's good. That's good. That's good. You know, everything else we can ignore and just go forward. What? Where? Where? 
We'll let them solve that until someone dies. Hey, buddy. Good job. You too, man. Could you help me out in the next areas? Alright, now this part... There's gonna be a lot of them. I don't even want to use that gun. I'm gonna go forward this time. Okay. Do I activate the other ones too? Oh my god. Seriously, there's just too many robot guys here. Such a hassle. I gotta do all that, and then I gotta run in lava for some reason. So, like, I'm just screwed now. grenade jump up to them to be safe but there's but just enemies there I'm so confused about what I'm supposed to do there and my save is way over here I might take a break and look this up because wow I definitely need to use the rocket launcher on those droid boys because that is ridiculous You have to grenade jump twice, so you're gonna lose at least a bar of health. And then you can- so that means you can only have a maximum of times two health. They designed it to be that way. So basically, I gotta get good. Because this is rough. Alright. I see what I gotta do. You literally just have to run past those enemies at the end. Oh, I think the flamethrower is really good for this part because it doesn't look like the the ass are affected by the flamethrower at all. Huh, I guess that comes from being cyborgs. Alright. So basically, once I get to the lava part, like, that big group of troopers at the end with all those grenade launchers, I need to kill them really quickly and as fat best as I can. Because the lava part, I just gotta, like, run away in a figure eight pattern and do my best. This part's a little tough. Oh, crap. Those guys are a bit tough, they're a bit squirrely. But they ain't no thing. Be careful here because I think, like, once I hit this button, a couple of more four will spawn and jump down from the bricks. I think, right? If I remember correctly. No? Yeah, there they are. I was trying to cheese it by doing the, um, uh...
non-compliant version. We actually don't, I don't think we need to talk to Dariel, but we'll do it anyway. Just in case. Just in case. This mission actually isn't too difficult. It's just designed in a very interesting way. You'll see, it's actually probably one of the shortest missions of the game, the last mission. gonna happen now. Let them handle their business. Alright, I think I'm ready. Let's do this. I need to wipe them out and then just run for it. I need to keep as much health as possible. Troopers should be right around this corner over here. It's fine. I'll go back around. I'll double back around. Alright, I think I'm good. I'm just gonna run for it. Oh wait, I need I definitely need to hit the other one. Oh. No! Okay. All right, you ready for this? Let's do it. Oh, I missed. Son of a beasting. Well, at least everything's dead, so I can just teleport over there now. Oh, and I got more grenades, so that'll help. Come on, Billy. All right, so now I'm here in the big room again. Got a grenade jump twice again. I don't know why that first grenade jump takes so much health. Like, why? Like, I never did that much damage before. All right, all right, all right. All right. Let's try this again. Thing is, I panicked. There it is. Hoo and this is the end. Marathon. In case you message from Leela. The final four attack is falling apart all over the ship. Small groups of armed aliens have surrendered to defenseless civilians in several areas, and the end is inevitable. The fight is over, and we must soon turn to restoration. There is surprisingly good news. Planet side, nine military Melinar Mark V or IV cyborgs were conveniently living among the colonists and acting together. They were able to single-handedly turn back the latter stages of the four assault. Casualties on the colony were nowhere near as high as those we ex uh, we experienced here on the marathon. I am disturbed by how easily the cyborgs were secretly assimilated into our midst, and believe that this event predates the marathon's launch from Mars 300 years ago, although the results were unquestionably for the best. Your presence on the marathon could have been to further weak wicked ends. I'm certain the real answer lies somewhere in the tumultuous, backstabbing politics of Seoul during the early 24th century. 
I have noticed that Durandell's records from this early pre-launch period are missing, but that their deletion occurred externally. And before Durandell became rampant, I do not believe Durandell himself brought the cyborgs on board, and I have other evidence that a human operator was influencing Durandell up to the time the marathon was launched. There are obviously many things which we do not understand, and may never be able to. The four ship vanished about 20 minutes ago. After venting nearly a thousand four bodies and other refuse, I am positive that Durandell is in control of the sh is in control, and fear that he might do what he might do with such a powerful ship during the jealousy stage of his rampancy. End message. Well then. Me holding an injured crew member. We did it. <laughs> Excuse me. Security officer complete. So you're not even a cyborg. You're just a security officer the entire game. Where are the credits? Don't tell me this word decided to freeze. Hello? Okay. You gotta click on it, actually. I didn't expect that. I should, I should have. I figured it out fast, at least, but still. For 17 years, the Renegade 4 scout ship jumped between the closely packed stars of the Galactic Core, charting and discarding nearly 7,000 systems before finally falling into a slow orbit around the second planet of the dim star 97 light years from the gravitational center of the Milky Way. Probes were constructed and launched with engines and instruments whose sophistication would have astounded both the four from whom technology had been stolen and the human programmers of the AI whose mad genius and directed their fabrication. The outlines of contents were mapped and along them the radioactive ruins of ancient cities were discovered buried underneath the shifting sand and rock of a global desert. A tireless, nearly immortal cybernetic crew of the ship were the genetically engineered descendants of the dead world below. The first of their race in a thousand years to return to their ancestral home. They came to search through the devastation of the ancient war in which they had been enslaved, to find a weapon of some piece of knowledge. To find a weapon or some piece of knowledge with which they could fight back against their oppressors. All over the ship, dancing through the wreckage of the four computer core, Durandell was laughing. So Durandell not only upgraded their ship, he, he went back to this S, this fit world, to find something. Oh, is that it? Should I just hit credits? Does it play? There they are. The Grizzly Ancients of Bungie. And that was Marathon. Surprisingly, for being such an old school game, and quite difficult at times, I did have a lot of fun with this one. It was nice to... It was definitely nice to go through it and see the little things that made it that were filtered out like the way they name things the way they design things because if you look at the hunters and then you look at the design of the hunters in halo they still have that like angular helmet like almost like a knight helmet like face and they also have that pointed arm that's longer than the other arm that has like the armored plate on it but i think both their arms in this in marathon they have like sort of a plate thing not to mention they change it to where instead of it being a shoulder gun it was a hand cannon but it was still green still green other than that there were a lot of changes with the other guys to me looking at the four the three-eyed ones the enslavers i really feel like they split those in half and all the parts that they liked, they used to design the elites that we see in Halo. And all the parts that were like more human and ugly looking when it came to like the colors and the shapes, 
I felt like became the prophets just from the way they looked. Maybe that's true. Maybe that's not. I didn't research it. I just noticed that like that symbol they kind of look like uglier versions of prophets and elites shoved together as if they had a weird three eyed baby. The weird, weird three eyed, red three eyed baby with um uh, lightning staves. But. The other ones, the troopers, I think they're just four, but with armor on, right? And they have the machine gun and grenade launcher. And, uh, I guess, I don't know what to say about the, um, uh, the spit, the yes, the cyborgs that are just, like, hovering robes with an energy ball and, like, a Dr. Fate helmet. Like, that was very inspired, but definitely didn't remind me of anything from the Halo series. Very different looking. And then there was the big, the big butt, uh, drones that launched the missiles that were like strangely shaped, I have to say, with those giant round asses. But they did remind me of the enforcers from Halo 2, because like they had like that face, that three eyed, the three red eyed face, which is funny because now that I think about it, yeah, that's the same three eyed design that the four had. And then you see it on the giant robots with the big butts next to the second to last level in Marathon. And then you see it again on the Sentinels, the Sentinel Enforcers in Halo 2 that crush the vehicles and launch missiles and red lasers. And you see how things like... You, you see... I don't know how to describe, like... The first idea... Like, these aren't rough drafts, these are final drafts for their game Marathon, but they became, they became rough drafts or templates for what would later be Halo. And it, it's cool to see the different design point. But, man, that was difficult. I think at some point we'll probably go through Marathon too. But, for now, I'm going to leave this one right here. I am very proud of myself for actually beating it, though, because that was a challenging game. I did have to look some stuff up, but in my defense, back in the day, when you bought a game like this, you got a box. It came with a manual. Those manual had a bunch of hints in it. And, um, uh, I mean, there was even... I, I mean, 1994, I can't even remember when Game Informer came out, but I'm pretty sure it, had been, it was out for a while. Otherwise, there's probably other older gaming magazines out there. I just... I never researched it, never looked into it, but if I had to guess, there might have been some mention of Marathon back in the day. I'm like, hey, here's some tips and tricks for you, kids. But thank you all. Hopefully you all enjoyed. I know I did. Please like, comment, and subscribe. Hit that like button. Keep on posting. I'll see you all in the next game. Y'all take it easy. Motherfucker. That's not good.